man dreads suffering and yet he suffers all suffering is due to affinity to matter the more one is attached to inert matter greater the suffering unaware of this principle man is attached to his body people and things all attachment amounts to distress one is attached to family because of ignorance bodily relationships are an extension of inertness with a false conception of belongingness to body and bodily relationships rigidity and inertness are introduced into the conscious element of the spirit the six deficiencies in the human character namely anger greed illusion or attachment pride lust and envy are a result of inertness or affinity to matter our wrong and incorrect understanding of life principles is also due to the error of mental association with matter it is important to recognize that the spirit is different from matter matter is ever changing transient and perishable spirit is changeless permanent and intact at all times spirit is timeless and causeless a simple understanding of the nature of spirit and matter is ever essential unless this understanding flowers into realization the heart shall not know joy the mind shall remain confused and will not be able to distinguish between what is appropriate and what is inappropriate there shall be no clarity naturally when there is no clarity inertness will hinder the flow of life force where life force is hindered unpleasantness and disease shall follow hence it will be a matter of great intelligence to understand the working of consciousness in terms of clear distinction between spirit and matter the more our mind and heart is trained to align with the permanence of spirit and the flow of consciousness the more we shall be free from inertness the more our awareness flowers the more we shall be free from disease and distortions of life